Murkrow knows. Murkrow knows something. Hey guys, Scope here, and we're back with more Let's Play Pokemon Soul Silver. In the last episode, we reached the bottom, or top, I don't know, of the rocket hideout, and we seen this guy in the door, who bears a resemblance to a old Pokemon um, villain. He seems to know us, gold. All right. This would be better with dialogue, but... Oh, what's this? He was in disguise. He's really just a little gray-haired fool. That bastard. You know, he looked kind of like uh, Giovanni, I thought. Interesting, since he was the leader of Team Rocket. All right, so we got another Rocket admin here. Um, I forget his name. It's like... Uh, I don't know. I'll flash it up on screen, but I forgot. It's, you know, it doesn't really matter. You only fight him, like, once in the game. So anyway, he's got a Zubat, which will just kill him like we kill any other Zubat with Thunder Punch. Just kidding, it's Thunder Shock. Oh my god, see? <laughs> I gotta make, like, a compilation video of how many times these guys have survived with 1 HP. That's what I, you know, I'll do that if it happens enough more times. Because it's kind of ridiculous. And it would be a little funny. We'll see. Alright. Go die, Zubat. Go die in a hole. Uh, yeah, I have a feeling we should change. Let's switch to, uh, Alley Boy. <coughs> Go, Al. Al hasn't seen any action lately, and he's pissed. Alright, wheezing. Perfect. We're gonna confuse your... You know, weird-looking self. Alright. Oh man, I thought he was going to survive with 1 HP. That would have been another for the compilation video. <laughs> nope, we're good. Alright, so this guy's, you know, he's an admin, but he pretty much sucks. I mean, this Raticate might be... Okay, yeah, he's got cheap, like, Super Fang, but it still it shouldn't be too bad, you know. Shouldn't be too hard. What? You call that, like, damaging? Let's try fly. We haven't seen that in battle yet, I don't think. Ow, flew up high. Alright. So yeah, even this admin battle isn't too hard. I guess I really didn't need to grind levels, but... You know, better than nothing. There's another boss battle coming up anyway. Let's see if we can't finish him off with confusion. Got another super fang. And Super Fang does damage equal to your level, by the way, so, for instance, Al's level 27, so it did 27 damage. <coughs> Sucker Punch. Alright, and Al, th that's his new move, Takedown. Very powerful, but it has recoil, I think. Alright, oh, Al's just about a level 28. So we beat the Rocket Executive. Alright, so he's gonna say how, you know, Team Rocket was disbanded three years ago and they're trying to bring it back so that they can contact their leader, Giovanni, and hopefully restore Team Rocket's former glory. And he runs into the wall like a goof. Bye. And then Murkrow walks up to us. I told you, he knew something. He knows the password to the room that we passed earlier. And then Murkrow runs off. Shouldn't you be in your Pokeball, Murkrow? Alright, actually, let's just leave Chicken out front. Yeah, we'll leave him out front. So anyway, we continue on through... What does this door go to? We didn't go in this... We didn't go up these stairs yet. Oh, cool, an item. TM46. Once again, I'll put that in annotation. As I have no idea what it is, but off, you know, the top of my head. <coughs> Alright, and so now we backtrack. I didn't fight those scientists off screen, by the way. Oh, look, there's Murkrow again. He's saying, follow me. Sure, buddy. Can I trust you, Murkrow? Can I trust you? Oh, there he is. Alright, that way? Okay, I'm coming. Wait up for me, Murkrow. Alright, so we went up these stairs. <laughs> Which leads us back to this room, and there he is again. Hey, little buddy. 
Right, and we're gonna save right here. I know I just saved, but you always gotta save before important battles. You never know. Oh, 14 hours, 33 minutes playtime. Six badges. Pretty crazy. Sometimes, of course, though, I just leave the game on and forget it there, so that could contribute to it. Alright, so what's Murkrow got up here? Alright, so this is the door that Murkrow knew the password to, and he opens it for us. Yay! Bye, Murkrow! Thanks, bud. So let's go in. Whoa, what is this contraption? Oh, oh no. We've got, um, more rocket admins here. They're gonna double team us. They're gonna jump us. That's dirty. Oh, not so fast. Not if Lance has anything to say about it. Dragonite, hyperbeam these bitches. Yeah, that would be cool, but no. So anyway, he's gonna fight the dude, and we're gonna fight this chick who looks like a dude. Oh, you know what? It's a double battle with Lance. Frickin' sweet. <coughs> Alright, that's new. So we got Drowsy and Arbok here. Alright, we got his Dragonite level fucking 40. Sweet! This is gonna be awesome. This is gonna be epic. Alright, yes. So, sadly, all we can really contribute is Thundershock. Thundershock Drowsy. Dragonite's gonna fly, very cool. Alright, chicken Thundershock, this bitch. I hope we can fit this battle in this episode. We should be able to. Alright, let's continue. Thundershock and Drowsy, I mean, I don't know what else to do, really. Oh, okay, cool. That works, too. I mean, he's level freaking 18. He's a bit overpowered, Dragonite. I mean, I don't got a problem with it. <coughs> Good thing I'm not fighting you, wink wink. Nudge nudge. Alright, so she paralyzed Dragonite. <laughs> Nobody paralyzes our friends. Alright, what do they got? Five Pokemon? Oh, we might be able to do it. Man, my Thundershock didn't do shit to Arbok. Crunch, hey? Thundershock Grimer, then. He's weak. <coughs> Fully paralyzed. What? Oh, how tedious. Alright, Thundershock Grimer again. You better stop that, Arbok. I don't like that. Not at all. And, of course, Dragonite's paralyzed, and I flinched, I think. Alright, Chicken's almost dead. Not good. Not good at all. Alright, we gotta kill somebody. No! Chicken! You fought valiantly, Chicken. Yeah, Dragonite, do your thing. Alright. We're kind of just sitting out right now, letting Lance uh, do his thing. Alright, who are we going to switch into? What's well, Sizo. Sizo for the win. <coughs> Sizo can take care of both these niggas. Alright, let's get... Let's get a Metal Claw in on... Grimer, maybe? Ow. Boom. Alright, Grammar's dead. Alright, Dragonite, where have you been, dude? You've been in the sky for like two turns. There we go. Alright, nice. Our box down. Two Pokemon left. The last pair. Last pair of balls. Oh, we got Murkrow. I wonder if that's the same one we saw earlier. The same one that helped us out. If so, that would be quite... Interesting. Dude, you can't you can't face Sizo, don't even play. Metal claw. Metal punch. Alright. Can't let you do that, Mokro. That was easy. Is that it? Oh no, we got another one. So he had two Pokemon, she had three. I say metal claw on this guy too. Just truck on through. Any help would be appreciated, Dragonite, you know. Whenever, just feel free to chip in. <laughs> Anytime is fine. Alright. 
Uh, let's finish it off, shall we? While Dragonite's up in the... Oh, no, we're asleep, I forgot. Dragonite's up in the sky, fooling around. Finish it, Dragonite! Alright, very cool. Why didn't he use Hyper Beam? I know he has it. I've seen him use it on that dude. Alright, size grew to level 28, sweetness. <coughs> we defeated the Rocket Executives alongside Lance. Very cool. <laughs> Alright, that's about it for time, though, so these guys are going to babble on some more. And in the next episode of Let's Play Pokemon Soul Silver, we will venture into this room that Murkrow led us into with Lance, and hopefully get to the bottom of this, you know, radio mystery thing that's going on here. See you guys next time.